Very, really I mean, broken team. Like, abnormally good. Yeah, Fox and teams, it's, you know, I mean, you throw us some good nares, you got some shines, and next thing you know, uh, Trill shine up smash later, and they're dead. Yeah. Let's see. Um, I think the starting stage for Double Fox would preferably be anything that isn't Dreamland. So, I'm, I'm hoping for an FD pick, because I think I FD is probably think the Dreamland most... I don't think is that bad. If they play it correctly, Dreamland is not even that bad. Yeah. Because, I, I mean, agree. you know, they just have to make sure, you know, when Peach is recovering, they kill Ham Yojo. Yeah, you just have to understand how to play on Dreamland. Really. It's like we got some hand warmers on Battlefield. Hmm? I, I... Um, I'm not really sure what to say for the time being, but I hope AOP has been practicing. The last time I uh, see him go to a Central Texas tournament was TGL, actually. The one TGL that I went to. And oh, he hopefully, made it out. hopefully he's gotten better from then. Then he seemed like he was kind of... Yeah, he he was stuck in like some really de uh, like odd defensive mindset where he just like kind of got a top platform at random. So uh, maybe hopefully now he, he's, yeah, I mean, he's a little more willing to actually commit and like play the game. Yeah, I mean, he's not playing Falco who has to do that. Yeah. Falco just kind of, you know, full hop down air top platform. Yeah, like you can, yeah, you can get away with it. Fox doesn't quite have that option. Start Battlefield. Also one of the neutral stages. Um, so Bunk, or not Bunk, Ham Yojo like, plays kind of weird in doubles, but he does a really good job of kind of just like reading what you're going to do and stuffing your approach. Or stuffing like any sort of aggressive option you pick. Yeah, he's very much the atypical Sheik in some ways. GP doing a good job quarter pressuring with the uh, up tilts. Neither character can really contest that, saying there's also a Fox behind them that will immediately punish them if they do get the whiff punish. So that, that was smart for GP. GP seems like a, a very double foxy kind of kind of team player. Yeah, I mean. Oh, he can't jump into that. Yeah, Every Sheik's gonna come down with an air. Yeah, he just took his time on the ledge a little too long. Oh, LP ledge dash up smash. Yeah, Bunk tries so. to chump check. You can't chump check. Chump check ledge dash is for O2 players. It yeah, LP is definitely not an O2 player. Yeah, he he's very good. I mean, he has top 100 wins. I th does he? Yeah. LP's good. Who did he beat? I don't remember, but I know he's I, 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 I mean, it's been, been a, it's been a year. It's been a year, so. Okay. Yeah, I mean, he's still but good. I mean, he never really loses to, like, anyone below his number. For the most part, yeah. I've never been, uh... Never mind. <laughs> um, yeah, but there... Double Fox is kind of working out. I mean, having Peach at a stock, like, deficit is really good. Just yeah, because she's the one who's probably stock tanking. Yeah, and you could uh, you could just like leave her alone, really. She she plays a large part, but like you can play around her well. And also, not backing at 140 is kind of odd when you up throw. But oh. big SD for me, LP. Very unlucky. Yeah. Let's see. Neutral is like so odd in this matchup. Double Fox is just really overwhelming, so it's hard to commentate. To, to be 100 fair. Oh, 100 percent no. honest. DP does a good ledge dash instead of jumping from ledge when Peach is down smashing there. You can get, you can actually like ledge dash up tilt through down smash. Obviously, you have enough invincibility and everything. Oh, oh another, another SD, SD. <laughs> another SD. Man, it's really not been looking bad for the foxes. Just yeah, I think they're like really bad SDs. That's all. They're awesome. doing most things correct. Well, not correct. I'm not sure what yeah, correct yeah. is to be honest. I, I can't say I'm very knowledgeable on Double Fox, but they're doing most things well. And, but it's just, they're kind of dying early because people are SDing. Yeah. Oh. Getting hit by backer, down smash. That's a kill. And it's officially oh. four stocks to two. Yeah. This is doable, it's, but it's very a, difficult. It's definitely a downhill battle. Oh, they're both going for the same <laughs> Yeah, they both run off stage, shines, shine, See, trying to just, shine That spike. just shows they don't really, you know, play that off together. GP does a good shot spike though. Corner pressure on PH. GP doing this is what I was talking about. He just kind of runs away and like plays defensively in positions where he actually just can pressure. Like that's his oh. biggest downfall. Both went for an up air and just hit each other. It really is a lack of synergy on ALP and GP's part. Yeah, it's no, it's hard I mean, to be synergized in this matchup to be honest. Yeah, I mean it's a great team, but still you know it's only a good team when you're synergized. You both have to be playing on the same level for it to work out. Yeah, to be fair. 
So I'm not sure it's stage they'll pick. Battlefield, they go back. Right back. I think Fox is very good on Battlefield. Double Fox is actually really good on Battlefield because I think in um, especially against like characters like Peach, not really Sheik, but Peach, where um, you can take way more control using platforms, and punish game becomes w way more expansive uh, with platforms, like relative to FD, for example. But um, really, I think. Well, it looks like they're doing much better now, if anything. They're actually yeah, getting... They're, they're throwing out more walls, you know, just more back airs. Yeah. They're really just walling off their opponents better. Um, and... But AOP doing the thing where you edge guard page and stuff to be winning, but GP covers the air dodge. Uh, that's actually a really hard air dodge to cover because you have to react. Yeah, you have to purely react to the air dodge. Yeah, the like, Peach air dodge is... Peach and Zelda both have weird... Yeah, they, they weird have, like, properties the, on their, uh... What is that? Air they have dodge. the air dodges that it, have, it like, keeps momentum, momentum afterwards, yeah. Yeah. But they actually have less frames of invulnerability than other dodges. Yeah. So. But it doesn't really matter, obviously. Back here. Good fair. <laughs> oh. Bunk jumps right into the wave shot. No smash. You can't do that. He saved oh. his teammate oh. by jumping into oh, it, but no. that's not what you want to oh. do. Well, at least got and it. And now it looks like Foxes have full control. Instead of 2v1 in pressure, yeah, I mean, we still AOP, got like I'm saying, defensive mindset, not really. I mean, AOP is not SD, still has four stocks. Yeah, he's definitely playing the, the stocky tank. Low tank. And like you said before, when Fox starts having, you know, stocks to give, it's. Oh, yeah. Fox can do whatever he wants. He can play so defensive that he can void interaction if he really wanted to. Oh, well, he's the best character in the game. <laughs> I mean, his back here is. And they're just. Good They're getting combo. some good team combos now. Oh, AOP could have upgraded that. Uh, it looks like AOP isn't... Well, obviously it doesn't look like AOP is very much of a team's player. But there's like I mean, crucial things where he's not like continuing combos. I'm mean, not doing correct pressure strings. GP's the one who's like trying to continue combos or add to them. Yeah. GP's the doubles like, player here. <laughs> you, you can kind of tell. But sometimes that's all you really need. Yeah, just I one, mean... I mean, you know, with Fox, it's like if the other player's just playing right and you can play around how he's doing. Yeah. Like, really, the whole thing is, if you're bad at doubles and you're playing double fox, all the, one of the foxes just kind of has to not die. I mean, yeah. that's, that makes it way easier, right? Up for what bears? Good smash, yeah. Oh. That oh. could be a stock, but I it's didn't think really he had difficult. Float still. I thought he might have lost it. Fox goes on the stage from there, so good on good on Bunk to not grab ledge. But dropping an edge guard, Rave shot up smash. He Ooh. actually, so that's um one of the really, like, things that no one thinks about, but if you're doing a wave shot up smash into yeah. someone, you actually, what he, you do he is you do waited. A, you, no, you do oh. a shorter wave dash. Oh, you do a shorter wave sense. dash and you um, get taper up smash instead of going right into them. And it gives him, it makes it way harder for him to like hit, hit you. But that's like very, very not really things people think about. <laughs> but oh. it's it's a real thing. But this is four, two stocks. Yeah. Two stocks total for each team. basically just don't get gimped. <laughs> yeah. This is, uh, okay. Uh -huh. Bunk gets stuck in his movement. Looks like it's going to game three. Just, one of them needs to just really get on ledge. See, AOP's not like pressure. Yeah, AOP like, should have. He's like trying to pressure, but you have to do active pressure. Like when GP got the ledge, you just. Yeah, good back there. I would have thought up just smash. up smash. Yeah, definitely up smash. Hold ledge, let AOP up smash. Yeah. yeah. They did the right time that time. But. Yeah. Game three. Oh, they're on, they're getting in sync. They use the same uh, victory pose. <laughs> they both held Y. <laughs> That's important. It really is. If you're on the same page, even in the victory screen, then you're truly a good team. Uh oh, Bunk has to readjust his chair. <laughs> Bunk currently coming out of retirement <laughs> for the third time. <laughs> for the twelfth time in the last two weeks. <laughs> um. See, this is a <laughs> nice up smash. He just runs in and does it to him. Fake. This is one of those stages where it's like it could go really well, but like we also remember like the King of Spaghetti Ploopy match where they lost on FD as the starting stage. In, uh, Upper? And oh, good backer. AOP actually contributing to the combo. Oh, more so. I thought I thought GP was going to go for that up smash. Yeah. You know, on the missed tech. Yeah. GP gets Definitely the wave shot of the shield on power shield, but kind of drops it. Could have been the stock it, at kill percent. Nice. Really good. Now you pressure. Oh, that's that's really good on uh, GP. Or There's no TO desk. Alex Gimme's right there. Uh, Alex Gimme. Yeah, he's, he's one of the TOs. ALP with a really good edge guard. Yeah. 
Shine Spike Bunk at 15%. That's, that, that's, that's big. Peach, you do not want to be dying at 15%. Yeah. Like, that's almost unacceptable. And GP still has all four stocks, so. Yeah, GP, GP holding stocks now. But well, this is the scary thing. Having AOP on um, on the forward is uh, diff it's 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 scary because I feel like he doesn't know how to play the aggressive. Okay, that's bad synergy right See, there. See, like they've done that a lot though. I mean, thankfully, you know, GP was still invulnerable, and AOPs was the one that came out. Yeah, GPs didn't hit him. So you know, but they they've they got, they got lucky. <laughs> they've hit each other a couple times with both of them going. For oh, that. that's oh. another shine spike at less than fifty. So yeah, it I looks mean, like Fox just he's getting shine spike. I yeah. mean, sometimes it happens. You're playing against Fox to get shine spike. And uh, Ham Yojo's like kill percent. That's combo. Really good nair oh. by um, Bunk, but that actually just meant ALP was two this. frames late. Right. <laughs> and ALP is uh, jumping off stage. <laughs> Nairing. Well, Ham Yojo is. Oh, turning into Zelda. Uh, he he doesn't to. go on the stage there. Oh, but Bunk does a Nair there? I think that was actually good synergy. Because <laughs> Ham Yojo also DI'd it, so it had to yeah. be good synergy. But here you can, um, if you back air, up smash. Okay. Well, you get, he I gets mean, the kill. Yeah, so it worked out. They have three stocks to play with, with Ham Yojo's last stock. It's looking like AOP and GP take it. Yeah, I mean, after. Well, I mean, let's. Oh, yikes. Oh. Yikes, GP. I mean, they're still fine. I mean, they're still fine, guys. Look at that team combo. Two hits. Yeah. <laughs> Back here. And I think AOP just wants to get the edge guard and the kill. Yeah, Grab just needs a whole ledge. Wave shine up smash. Oh, <laughs> they could have done the wave shine. Yeah, they could have done or, you the, know, the wave shine shined. infinite back and forth. <laughs> oh, that would have been a... I think he meant to wave shine off there. Up but there. And they clutch it out. I mean, you know, really, that was that was really Bunk's game to lose. I mean, he got, <laughs> he got he died he got twice under 50%. Yeah. I mean, as Peach, you got to be a stock tank. You can't be dying, you know. Yeah. It, it's That matchup's, uh, well, that team is kind of hard to play with. Peach, Peachy, because it's one of those things where you swap roles so often, but one of the characters can't actively play both roles well. Yeah. Like, she can't really play aggressively, well, safely at least, and then... Yeah. It makes Beach just have to be even more proactive, and if you're able to fit the role, then it's, it's like, wow. That